collective beautiful collective welcome back to the channel thank you guys for all of your generosity your support your beautiful comments okay let's go messages for the collective spirit please and thank you whoa embrace uncertainty you're abundant here avoid drama that's what it's saying you're being protected from drama. Okay. It's like protect your blessings, protect your abundance, protect your love. Everything is being protected here. But you need to avoid this madness, this drama. What's going on? You've taken the lead. You've had to. You've had to cut your losses and you've had to transform. You've had to change because whatever is going on you just like i can't go down this road i cannot go down this road period i'm not doing it what's going on collective you have a bright future everything is going to be fine so you've had to take notice of someone's inconsistencies, look deeper into a situation. Things are not how they seem. Actions you take now will bear fruit. Charge ahead with your plans and see it through full fruition. You've had to go into solitude. Someone was believing in illusion or someone who was setting up an illusion here. You had to get your priorities set straight. And your priorities is looking at your future. And you are not, yeah. Oh, gee. Something, sometimes the universe will bring you full circle to a place that you've been before to finish unfinished business. So it's almost as if you have been brought back to really get the truth about something. Peace. Protect your peace from negativity. If you can't find peace with yourself, you will not find it anywhere else. So this is it. The energy of love surrounds you. Open your heart and you will attract what your heart desires. You've had a creative spark. The creative power within you is far greater than you realize. Unlock your creative genius. So somebody had you believing you did not have a bright future. Someone had you believing an illusion about yourself. Um... And you've had to go into solitude to get your priorities set straight again. Past life guides. A personal guide. The Ascendant Masters. Okay. This is about self-acceptance, compassion for self, and forgiveness. So it's like you've had the goddess of dreams, visions, intuition, and receptivity, learning a new path, the teacher. Yeah, so somebody was gossiping under the emotional influence of other people, thinking they were going to get a great reward. It's an illusion. This is prophets and ancient seers getting predictive guidance and making decisions. So you've had to be in isolation here to bring you this joy, these blessings, and trusting your own intuition. Soul expression, doing something new, a creative spark, sowing your seeds and they are flourishing. So embrace this um, on period of uncertainty. You've had a personal guide, a guardian angel, um, or your spirit family guiding you to a new beginning. 
being very mindful here. This is the wisdom of the Magi. Here is animal totems, animal energy and powers. So it's like finding your, your soul tribe, finding your spirit family, finding... Uh, look, somebody was trying to sell you an illusion. I just want to find out about this illusion. What's this illusion? What is this illusion? Is this self-delusion? Is this an illusion from some, your ex? Is preying on the downfall of your new love interest? Retrograde. Hmm. Making shit trickster spirit. sudden loss of memory things ending up going missing you could have been like what happened to this what happened to that am i am i dreaming here am i seeing things am i hearing things you know ask what what went missing what went missing what went missing here? What went? What's this trickster spirit all about? What's this trickster spirit all about? Tell me about things going missing. family accusing you of stealing something yeah it's like somebody's family was accusing you of stealing something Tell me about this theft. Tell me about this theft. Money? Or or an item or a ring? Somebody's family accusing you of stealing a ring. the frick is this all about? Somebody is lying about you. They're accusing you of stealing a ring. Somebody's family is accusing you of stealing a ring. judging you somebody's lying this is a, a feminine energy it could be a mother a sister a daughter an auntie you fricks they're lying it's an illusion. So somebody accused you of stealing a ring, but you didn't. It's an illusion. They're created an illusion.
why somebody's mad. That's why everyone's getting mad about this damn ring. So somebody is accusing you or accusing you of stealing a ring. But they may be regretting now because somebody could have been Oh, this emperor, okay. Oh, come on. They're doing this, making up a story to create drama. They're manipulating. Oh, oh, oh. somebody. You got somebody, I don't know if it's their family or your family, someone accused you of stealing a ring. But you didn't. You're telling the truth. I don't know if they even told you about it. I don't even know if you know what you're being accused of. They think you stole a ring. caused everybody to turn against you and be pissed off at you. It's like, I don't need... It's called, it's caused doubt and uncertainty in you. People didn't know if they should trust you. Or not trust you. Somebody's made up a story that you stole a ring. So you could have been at your person's house, for example, if it's them. You could have been at your person's house and a ring gone missing. You didn't take it. Somebody else took it. If it's your own family... You've been accused of, like, stealing a ring. Maybe your mother's ring or your grandmother's ring. Holy Jesus. There's a trickster energy. It's almost like somebody set you up for a fall. It's like, if you noticed, all of a sudden, either your person turned against you, became cold and distant toward you. They weren't telling you the truth. 
someone accused you of theft, accused you of stealing a ring, maybe a mother's ring. All this shit over a ring that you didn't take? Someone deliberately lied about this and manipulated the situation for self gain. So they made up a lie about you that you're not you're you're innocent of. You're not guilty of this. This is an unfair judgment. Tell me more about this ring. 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 Me about this ring. Somebody took it themselves. said you were not to be trusted and that they should break up with you because you're a thief. Somebody has deliberately done this to make it look like you're a thief, that you stole a ring. It could be an engagement ring, a wedding ring, a family ring, I don't know, some fucking ring that you didn't take. made people not trust you. Something is coming full circle. What? Somebody is lying. They're manipulating. They made the story up because they were jealous. They're lying. They're jealous. They did this so other people or your person would not trust you. So that people would turn their back on you. Hell, you don't need to steal nothing. They're like, that's why somebody just turned their back on you and abandoned you. Cause people to be angry at you. It could be your. Somebody is a trickster. Somebody lied. They 
weren't sure for sure. Like people weren't sure. It was to cause a breakup. Beats me. Somebody stole a ring. Or alleged you stole a ring. But you're innocent. I don't even know if you know what you were accused of. This person just dropped you like a hot potato. Said you stole something and it's a ring. Maybe it's a grandmother's ring. Maybe it's a mother's ring. I don't know. But somebody accused you of stealing it, but you didn't take it. I don't even know if you know. Somebody kept it for themselves and blamed you for it. Mmm, -hmm. mm, it's an illusion. Trickster energy. Somebody was greedy and took it for themselves and blamed you for it. Can you believe this? Your person may have turned on you. Because they thought you stole their mother or their grandmother's ring or something like this. It's these little fuckers right here. Somebody got together and conspired to make up a story that a ring went missing. I don't think the ring went missing at all. I think they set you up for it. I don't think a ring even went missing, to be honest with you. I don't even think there was a ring to go missing. Somebody else picked up the ring and put it in their own pocket. To make it look like you did it. I don't even know if you know about it. I don't think they've even said anything about it. At least not to you. Whoa. an odd message to come out and read now, isn't it? Somebody accused you of stealing a ring. But you're not guilty of it. This could have been your soulmate's uh, mother's ring. Somebody made up an allegation you stole the ring when you were in their house. And this person was at a crossroads like, are they a thief? Are they a thief? It was unjust. They were, it was an unfair judgment. Hidden enemies did it. <laughs> Said you're a thief. 
Oh my God. Anybody ever come to me and accuse somebody of being a thief? The first person I'm going to suspect is the person who is doing the accusing. I work in opposites, guys. I always have. I'm always suspicious of people who make accusations like that because it's usually them who is the thief. Stealing a ring. They didn't act alone. It says, use your intuition. Watch for signs. The truth will be coming out. Huh. Not funny how people do that, eh? Set people up. Oh, the collective was in the house. They stole that ring. Maybe your soulmate had their mother's ring or had some fucking third party who stole it. They planned it to make you look like a thief. I don't even think there was a ring. If it was stolen, it was stolen by somebody else. Yeah, well, if they can't even tell you about it. If they can't even tell you about it, then... <laughs> so this person wasn't sure if they give... Planned. And then this person got really hurt. It's the Emperor. Something's coming full circle. The truth is coming out. So whatever you were accused of, they're finding out you were innocent of. They might actually, like, see that somebody wearing that ring or somebody says something about the ring or somebody, they're finding out you were innocent of the whole thing. It was a big fucking trickster lie to make them think, don't you? Put confusion in their head, thinking you're a thief. You were innocent. And they couldn't even openly tell you that? Didn't even give you the chance to, like, defend yourself? You were just assumed and presumed that you were guilty? Holy God. Nice people finish last, right? <laughs> <laughs> you try to do somebody a favor, like maybe you cleaned up their house, or maybe you helped and assist this person. That's the thanks you get, eh? And then before you know it, like maybe their mother passed away or something. Maybe you helped clean up their house. Maybe you helped do something and then next thing you know you're accused of stealing a ring but you were not guilty of it somebody is is a trickster and they made it look like you stole the ring but you didn't steal nothing and i don't think a word was spoken about it you were just assumed and presumed you were guilty that's an unfair judgment and something is coming around full circle where the truth about this ring is coming out.
Take care.